In this module, we'll return to the DMAIC method. We'll start by discussing the first phase of the method in detail, the define phase. In this phase, we'll discuss the inputs, tools, and outputs. The inputs for the define phase are the need for the Six Sigma project, executive management sponsorship, and the core team identified. Let's start with the need for a Six Sigma project. A Six Sigma project is important for two reasons. One, it's different from traditional quality measures meant to ensure that there is conformance to internal requirements. And two, Six Sigma methodologies emphasize more value for money by improving customer satisfaction and reducing costs. Some other benefits include improved customer satisfaction, improved internal processes. This can be done through either process reengineering, which is a major process change, or process improvement, which is a minor process change, decreased defects or errors, decreased costs, and long-term viability and competitive advantage. Let's move on to executive management sponsorship. What is it and why is it important? Executive management sponsorship is one of the prerequisites for any Six Sigma initiative. So what does executive or senior management provide? Executive or senior management provide a high level need for the Six Sigma project and resources required for the project. The resources are of two types. The first is human resources. Human resources refer to the people who participate in the project. The second type of resource is financial support. Executive management also coordinates with other internal groups and is responsible for providing motivation and support to initiate and sustain the Six Sigma project. Now we'll move on to discussing the concept of core team identified. It is the executive sponsor's responsibility to identify and assign core team members to the project. Okay, so who are the members of the core team? We'll start with the project manager. A project manager is responsible for coordinating activities for the project. This person is answerable for the knowledge or product management methodology. He or she is responsible for project deliverables and for managing cost, scope, time, risk, human resources, and communications for the project. The second member of the core team is the Six Sigma expert. Now, what is the importance of the role of a Six Sigma expert? First, a Six Sigma expert is preferably a Six Sigma green belt or black belt. Second, a Six Sigma expert understands Six Sigma methodology and serves as liaison between the Six Sigma black belts, master black belts, and the project team. Third, a Six Sigma expert has the ability to interact with other subject matter experts in different fields, for example, finance and human resources, who may be involved in providing expertise whenever required. The other members of the core team are additional product or process experts. These are people who may be assigned to the core team. Some examples include people with intimate knowledge of the process and subject matter experts.